Question. Write the critical appreciation of the poem Second Coming. Title. Critical appreciation of the poem The Second Coming. The Second Coming is a highly acclaimed poem written by W.B. Yeats, an Irish poet, and one of the most significant literary figures of the 20th century. First published in 1920, the poem has garnered immense critical attention and has come to be regarded as a seminal work in Yeats' oeuvre. This critical appreciation aims to explore the poem's profound themes, innovative use of language, and its lasting impact on literature. One of the striking aspects of the second coming is its exploration of a world in crisis, reflecting the tumultuous period of history in which it was written. Yeats vividly captures the chaos and uncertainty of the post-World War I era and the disintegration of traditional values and structures. The poem's opening lines, turning and turning in the widening gyre the falcon cannot hear the falcona, immediately establish a sense of disconnection and disorientation. The image of the falcon, symbolic of order and control, unable to respond to its falcona represents the breakdown of societal order. Furthermore, Yeats introduces the concept of a rough beast slouching towards Bethlehem, a metaphor for an impending apocalyptic force. The use of biblical references, such as Bethlehem, and the association of the rough beast with the second coming of Christ, adds a sense of foreboding and spiritual unease. The poem's central theme revolves around the loss of faith in traditional belief systems and the apprehension of an impending catastrophe, both on a personal and global level. The language employed in the second coming is highly evocative and contributes to the poem's enduring impact. Yeats' skillful use of imagery creates vivid and haunting visuals that linger in the reader's mind. Phrases such as blood and tide, ceremony of innocence is drowned, and mere anarchy is loosed upon the world encapsulate the chaos and violence of the time. While simultaneously conveying a sense of inevitability. Another notable aspect of the poem is Yeats' use of symbolism. The falcon, the sphinx, and the rough beast all carry symbolic weight, representing different facets of the modern world. The falcon embodies the loss of control and a disconnection from traditional authority. The sphinx, a mythical creature associated with riddles and enigmas, symbolized the intellectual confusion and uncertainty of the age. Lastly, the rough beast represents the destructive and malevolent forces that threaten to engulf society. The second coming has had a lasting impact on literature and continues to resonate with readers today. Its themes of societal upheaval, spiritual crisis, and the collapse of established structures remain relevant in an ever-changing world. The poem's profound insight into the human condition and its ability to articulate the anxieties of its time make it a powerful and enduring work of art. In conclusion, the Second Coming is a masterful poem that explores the disintegration of societal order and the anxieties of a world in crisis. Yeats' innovative use of language, vivid imagery, and symbolic depth create a haunting and thought-provoking work. Its enduring relevance and impact on literature make it a testament to Yeats' poetic genius and its critical appreciation continues to inspire readers and scholars alike.